And uh, so with the drops, how do you take the drops? Did you put it in your food? You just take it with the... Put it right under your tongue. Put it in the water? Oh, it's right under your tongue. Yeah, I'll show you. Put it to the camera. Right now, I got a little bit in there, but... Okay. Yeah, I'll take some right now. Right under your tongue, you just let it sit. Uh, from what I hear, you let it sit for a little while until it is gone. Some people, like, swallow it, but it's yes. best to, to let it get into your bloodstream before your digestive stream. Okay, that makes know. sense. So those two are better for uh, relieving pain and stuff? Yeah. All right. Yeah. Then THC, then just smoking it. So right. I really, I really can't smoke THC no more because my heart rate gets too fast. I get paranoid, and uh, I get too. I I start tripping. Oh, the THC. <laughs> Off right. the THC, you know. And then, for me, getting out the military, smoking THC was a stress reliever. Now it's the opposite. Oh, uh, it's a stressor. It's a stressor now. Dang. Yeah. That's crazy. And the CBD hasn't been. Okay, so, so CBD is a better uh, choice. Yeah, so I've been doing strictly CBD right now. Cool. cool. Uh, they even got flower CBD. I'll show you that. It's, you don't see this often in places under THC limit if if it captures that. Uh -huh. So there's no THC in here. I can like legally travel, possibly out of the states. I ain't looked up the laws and regulations. Uh -huh. <laughs> there is no THC in here. It looked like some homegrown stuff, you know, because it, it ain't it ain't cured like you know the really top shelf weed looking all pretty and shit, <laughs> and all that modified shit. But yeah, so that's C CBD is good. CBD, CBD over THC. Yeah, yeah. As far as medicinal.